I got an offense here in Curator that I need to investigate. Well, looks like there's some email, some proxy, you know, some uh, antivirus detecting. I mean, somebody may have done something bad here. Let, let me actually take a look at the 25 events that contributed to this offense. Interesting. Let me make this bigger. So it looks like it uh, started down here with... Uh, that's my email server and it's going to a site in Canada. Hmm, and look, <laughs> executable code detected. So somebody downloaded an executable there. And that's the source IP of a user and this is the user lands. And yeah, and I get an idea. It looks like the proxy is actually a uh, complaint. Let me actually take a look at that proxy event. Uh, yeah, and sure enough, uh, he has gone to a malicious sources malnet is classified by my blue code proxy that's interesting uh, well I need to know a little bit more about this and let me see if I can extract some information on the rules I always like to in any offense to displace the rules and I get suspicious outbound and that's uh, probably yeah that precisely that one on going into that ma malicious side that we just saw we got a couple of uh, antivirus events, and that's a standard ruling curator that processed that. An email with suspicious file attachment received, and that's a rule that basically, from the email server, extract the custom property file name, and if it ends in .zip, exit. Okay, so somebody downloaded an executable here. Well, for me to investigate this in detail, I'm gonna have to start by you know, getting some of the hashes that uh, had been uh, collected here. So let me start with the first one. Get the hash. I need to go copy it here. Go to virus total, paste it, and go into forums and begin to investigate. This is going to take a lot of time to find out who's behind this and how can I, how if anyone else is has actually been targeted um, with this. What other websites are related to this? This is going to take a while unless I click on my Watson tab and I have that offense here and I can have Watson investigate the particular event. And Watson has found 54 observables in here. Let's actually explore inside. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Let me actually go in stage one to see. Uh -huh. So this is what uh, was sent to Watson couple of uh, automatically got all those uh, you know antivirus signatures a bunch of hashes that I don't have to do uh, URLs related you know wow user identity and this is actually all contributed by curator being sent to Watson and I even like it already I mean this this tells me you know which, which are the IP addresses that are the main actors in here here's the lens the antivirus information collected in here bunch of hashes it's actually pretty good let me actually go to stage two look at that <laughs> that's a malicious organization let me actually click on this uh, cozy duke that's the russians guy that were uh, discovered by Karpes karspersky i believe it was uh, and look at that, there are some URLs of the forums that I don't need to, if I want to see them, I don't really want to. And it's actually warning me that some of these links may be malicious, so I have to be careful here. But it's, you know, the level of certainty that Watson is telling me, 71%, this is definitely uh, Cozy Duke. Uh, I have uh, some more you know, documents that were d downloaded by this particular guy. Oh, actually, this is information. Notice that that's interesting. This is stuff that is not part of my offense. Everything that is in blue here, like blue, this is stuff that Watson has seen related to this hash file that I had. So maybe I want to check for this uh, document and see th this is a particular DLL, not a document, this is a DLL, and see who else may have downloaded that. We have uh, uh, other URLs, other documents. All this stuff that is in light blue is stuff that is related uh, 
to this type of attack and this really saves any SOC operator at least five hours and I doubt it that you will be able to find even with enough dedication all this data uh, that Watson gets uh, to you in a matter of minutes. So now if someone asks me if, if anyone else has been fall victim of this or this lands alone, well I have a bunch of hashes that I can proactively go ahead and, and take a look at them and see if they if they are these are these are again light blue, this is not related, this is related to the offense, but it's not part of the stuff that curators send to what's for investigation. So I can actually begin to look for this and see if I see indications of they might be this might be a campaign against uh, my company. No, so this is a a great uh, way of really analyzing complex offenses that have a lot of uh, data out there that I don't have the time to you know Google this and in fact some of this stuff is not even indexed so I cannot even find it by googling but Watson did it for me.